Hi and welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about the Alpine Stars SMX5 boot, which is Alpine Stars entry level sports boot. And these cost £134.99. pence. These have been around since 2009 and they live up to the old adage, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this design and hopefully these will keep charging on for years to come. There is absolutely nothing complicated about these boots whatsoever. They cover all the basics really well without doing anything super flash. The exterior is made from microfiber, which is a synthetic leather, so you know you're gonna get a consistent finish throughout. They've got plastic protection at the heel, at the toe, and then this shin guard around the top. You've also got sliders at the back and around the back of the heel so that if, you, if anything does go wrong, you know that you've got extra protection there. Dead simple on and off. Undo the Velcro flap, undo the zip, and you're out. There's not even the gusset from a waterproof membrane to worry about. On that subject, that possibly does decrease the practicality for some people. There are boots available around this money that have got a waterproof membrane in them but not everybody wants that. There's, in good weather, a waterproof membrane is likely to make your feet sticky. So having a good solid pair of boots without them is not necessarily a bad thing. We've had 150 customer reviews on these boots over the years and the average score for them is 4.9 out of five. That is beyond belief. These are incredibly popular. Some of the customers we've had are on their second and their third pair in that time and keep coming back for them. I would say the SMXs are a sports boot rather than a race boot. There's no reason you can't wear these on track, but it's not really what they're designed to do. You haven't got the plastic ankle bracing that you'd have on a higher level boot like an Alpine Star Super Tech, but you have got the basics you need and they're rated to the latest CE standard. They've got, they've got level two for height and then they meet level one for the three technical tests, which are for abrasion resistance, for transverse rigidity, which is resisting a, a sideways crush weight, and then also for impact and cut, where a knife blade is thrown onto that outer to make sure that it can't penetrate through. So you know you're getting good solid protection with those CE ratings and all of that plastic protection around there. The plastic toe slider has got a really simple method of detaching them. You just pop away and slide it forward, and it's real simple to put back on hook underneath, tap back on. It's on and off in seconds and it's easy to buy replacement sliders there. In terms of extra practicalities, the gear change pad on both boots, which just protects that upper from any contact with the gear lever to avoid the wear. You've got ventilation coming in just above the accordion panel here. And again, on the, on the side here around the malleolus, there's a room for some air intake there. 11 years Alpine Stars have been making these boots and as I said, incredibly popular with people. So having done a couple of hundred miles in these, I can see the popularity. I can see why people are absolutely in love with them and buy them again and again. I think they're really, really impressive pair of boots and are a credit to Alpine Stars. If you've got any questions or any comments or if you've got any experiences of these boots of your own that you want to pass on to other people, please pop them in the comments below. And if there's a question there for us, we'll do our best to get back to you on that as soon as we can. Thanks for watching.